Here's Brody Brazil. What my heart wants for the Stanley Cup playoffs of 2022, my heart wants the Florida Panthers to win the Stanley Cup. And I've already talked about my head wanting the Avs. They're the logical team. They're the logical choice. I'm not saying that Florida doesn't make sense to win it. They're a very good group this season too, but maybe more of the emotional and sentimental connection. Why? Well, for obvious reasons. Joe Thornton's on that team. Jumbo has not played every game this season by far. In fact, he missed a long stretch of time uh, here in early 2022. In fact, before he came back in that game against San Jose in March. Um, You just have to think, based on the way things have gone this year, he's contributed to Florida, he's been important for them, but he has not played on a regular basis. I'm not going to sit here and tell you the odds of whether he plays again next season, but I am going to say, let's state the obvious. Let's look at what's obvious. I don't know how long he's got left. So I want this for Jumbo. He's on a team to do it. They're in a position to do it. I I really, (laughs) this is what the heart wants from a Sharks perspective, Florida to win it all for Joe Thornton. I would also say, just looking at the Florida situation, you know, Tampa has won each of the last two Stanley Cups in rare and unusual situations and seasons and circumstances. You had one season cut short. You had last season, which was expedited. Everything's been difficult. Tampa earned it, right? But if you're going to stick with the Florida theme and you wonder how the Panthers are feeling watching their state rivals win two Stanley Cups in a row, yeah, this would kind of counteract Tampa. I don't dislike Tampa, but I think it would be fun if Florida followed that up with a Stanley Cup win. The Panthers this season... We talked about all the Avs success and flirting with 120 points. It was the Panthers who were the first team to clinch a berth into this postseason. So no question, they're a favorite, they're a front runner. But it's also a bunch of names on this team that are the excellent players who are not household names. Huberdeau, Barkov, Reinhardt, Ekblad, Duclair, these are all players who are producing at a high clip, a high level, on a complete regular basis, but because they don't play in Toronto, New York, Vancouver, Chicago, Philly, Boston, they're not getting the same attention because of where they're at and just the media cycle. I'm, I'm sorry, but that's just the way it is, and that's the way it works. I would love for those names to get what they deserve in winning a Stanley Cup, and I think that would, that would definitely elevate their, their status in the league. Players know, right? Every player knows that these are tough opponents to go up against, but I want it for the fan perspective, the notoriety perspective too. So the Panthers have already clinched the playoffs. This is, I say, only the eighth time in franchise history. It's not a lot for them, but it's their first time getting in the postseason three years in a row, which is odd because, right, the Sharks are out of it for the first time for three years in a row, and the Panthers are in for three, but... You kind of understand, like, this is a high point in their franchise. They want to capitalize on this. And going back to my number one thing, they've got Joe Thornton. And that is why the heart wants the Florida Panthers to win a Stanley Cup this year. 